I am Darth Vader. Hi, my name is Jay Caird, and this is my embarrassing story. Now, when I was in middle school, I wanted nothing more than to be in the student council. So when I saw that they were holding elections, I just knew that I had to run. I decided to put my name in the ballot for Sarge at Arms. Why? Because that position sounded awesome. Now, like every other student running, I also had to create a slogan, put it on a poster, and put that poster up in the school. However, we also had to create a four to six minute speech to give to every other student in the school and the teachers. This would be done during an assembly. Now the day of the assembly came and I was feeling really good. And then sixth period hit and I started to get butterflies in my stomach and I felt really nervous. Now this would be my very first time ever doing public speaking and it would be done in front of 600 people. I thought there was no way I could do it. However, I still went through with the speech. And lo and behold, because my name starts with a C, I had to go first. My first line went great, but then from that point forward, my entire body started shaking. It started from my legs and just moved its way up. So I decided to grab the podium in a way to stabilize myself. However, the podium started shaking. So here I am, reading off a piece of paper with my podium and my body all shaking. And trust me, it was very noticeable to everyone. So for some reason, I decided to stop midway through my speech and take a couple deep breaths. However, I never realized that the microphone was still up to my mouth. So as I got up there, every other student inside that gym heard this sound. And it sounded none other than like Darth Vader. So from that point forward, whenever someone brings up that speech, I am just known as the Darth Vader speech. And it was very embarrassing towards me. Something I hope to never happen to me again. And one of the inspirations for me going through and trying to get better in public speaking. So, that is my most embarrassing story. And with that, I thank you.